As curtains fall on the life of the first African woman to win the coveted award, accolades are pouring in for two other African women alongside an Arab woman who have now risen to Madai's distinguished rank. This year's Nobel Peace Prize has been awarded jointly to Liberian President Ellen Johnson Sirleaf, a Liberian peace activist Leima Bowie and Tawakul Harman, a Yemeni pro-democracy activist. The three were recognized for their non-violent struggle for the safety of women and for women's rights to full participation in peace-building efforts. We cannot achieve democracy and lasting peace in the world unless women obtain the same opportunities as men to influence developments at all levels of society. 72-year-old Ellen Johnson Sirleaf made history when she became Africa's first elected woman president in 2005. She took over power in a nation traumatized by 14 years of brutal civil war that left 250,000 people dead, caused thousands to flee abroad and ruined the country financially. But her rise to power might not have been possible without the efforts of Lema Bowie a 39-year-old activist who led Liberia's women to defy feared warlords. Tawakul Harman, the first Arab woman to win the Peace Prize, is a 32-year-old Yemeni activist and journalist. The Norwegian Nobel Committee hopes that the prize to Ellen Johnson Sirleaf, Lema Bowie and Tawakul Harman will help to bring an end to the suppression of women that still occurs in many countries and to realize the great potential for democracy and peace that women can represent. The three are expected to receive the award, which includes a 1.5 million US dollar cash prize, the equivalent of 150 million shillings, sometime in December in Oslo, Norway. Sylvia Chebet, Citizen Weekend.